Okay. Suzuki? Again! <gasps> Vanishing! No! Not like this! Help! Help me! No! Could it be? Is he? <clears throat> Use the antivirus program. Just bring them back to Flodia. The Enforcers turned into Omega Mon Alter B now. Is reincarnation still possible? I don't know, but we've got to try. We stopped the AR plan, but the digital world is still in crisis. Reincarnation is ready to launch. Let's hurry back to town. Oh, I never said. After all this time... Can you get the Enforcer? I'll bring this one. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty... It's not that apparent, but the signs are showing. This kid has been possessed by the curse of the man who tried to take over the digital world in the original title over 15 years ago. Yeah, it's Analog Man. It's him. That's how he recognized Mameo. I mean, that's how we recognized his recognition of Mameo. How the hell did he come back, though? Look! Suzuki! Uh, oh. Where am I? Suzuki, you're awake. Mr. Mameo? Huh? What are you doing calling him that? He's... He's my homeroom teacher. What? No, wait. What? Mr. Mamio's a real teacher? Well, I do teach Japanese at his school. Mamio taught the bad guy? Aw, oh, jeez. I've been impolite this whole time. But he is not at my school, so I should be fine, right? You may want to be more polite around your elders, regardless of whether they're your teacher or not. Yes, I suppose I'd better. Enough wasting time. We need to begin the reincarnation. That's right. Reincarnation starts now! this whole town to purify and renew the digital world by taking it apart and putting it back together again. Taking it apart, putting it back together, and making it anew? It's our plan to wipe out the BH program you are spreading. Will that be effective on anything and everything that's made of digital data? This is just to clean up the pH program, so it only targets things that were infected. But I suppose if we tried, we could use it on every single thing in this world. Then, would you do this for me? Would you disassemble me? I don't need to be reassembled. So, you're asking us to delete you from this world altogether? I've done so many terrible things. I deserve this. It's good you're remorseful, but this is scary. I think the weight of his crimes hit him when he was freed from the curse. Curse? The lingering hatred of a man I've defeated. After the final battle in the singular zone, I saw him leave Suzuki's body. Yeah, I knew it was him. It was Analog Man. This boy is the victim of that curse, you say? No. 
I sought out the singular zone myself, felt the curse, and gave my body up to it. It was all me. Everything is my fault. Lush, I've done such awful things to you. Surely you despise me. I want to smack you, but I won't. Huh? When I looked at Shoma, I remembered something. Your memories came back? Yeah. I used to be a Digimon. I had a kind partner, and I was the happiest Digimon ever. But then, something went pop. And then, for a long, long time, I was in a dark place. Pop. I was all alone. I was cold and lonely and real scared. And I cried and cried until I heard a voice. Shoma's voice. I tried real hard to follow the voice. And then I found him. So you met Suzuki in the Singular Zone? The tales of Digimon who lose their partners ending up in the Singular Zone were true. But the Singular Zone's huge. To be called by a human who accessed it by chance and actually meet them? Miraculous! That was no miracle. It might even have been inevitable. How do you mean? Tamers and partners are drawn together. Just as you and your partners were, and Kota and Himari and their partners were. No matter how much time passes, the ties between them continue to bind. They can never be severed. Wait, you're saying Lush and Suzuki were that way too? But if they were, then how could he do something so awful to Lush? Could Suzuki have been unaware that Lush used to be his partner? I had no idea. Actually, why would you discard your partner like that in the first place? Back in the tournament, I... lost to this tamer. Tournament? You mean back in fifth grade? Didn't you win that time? No. I lost. I saw those two in the semi-finals, and I realized I couldn't win. So I... I cheated. I modded my partner's data. Quick PSA, folks. The price of cheating. You know what they say, cheaters never prosper. And for good reason, too. I did win the battle, but I'd lost before it began, really. I came out on top, but with an awful feeling in my chest. I meant to do it over. Once my partner revived, I'd win fair and square, I thought. But... My partner never revived. I think... I think it was because I modded the data. I discarded my partner and started raising a new Digi-Egg. I wanted the ultimate Digimon. I gathered all kinds of info. Anything the network could tell me, I wanted to learn. But in the process, I first heard of the digital dive. I became obsessed. I dove again and again. The more I did it, the bigger the world became. And then, one day, just before summer vacation, I discovered the Singular Zone. Right around when you stopped coming to school. The Singular Zone was full of the unknown. Ruins of Digimon I'd never seen. Huge clouds of mysterious data in them. I found data fragments glowing with an odd light. In the light, I saw the potential for an ultimate Digimon. I suppose that must have been the curse. It's clear to me now how foolish I was, but... In the moment, I was overjoyed, and I reached out to touch the light. From that moment, madness lived within me. And the rest... Well... The rest you all know. 
I made the BH program based on the curse, made the network gaps, destroyed the meddling enforcer, formed the AR plan. I remade Loosh using the ruined data I found in the singular zone. And I used her. These are all my crimes. My unforgivable crimes. But Shoma, I met everyone thanks to you. There was plenty of bad stuff, but I was happy I got to meet you all. So, I'll let you off with no snacks this time. <laughs> <laughs> Lush. But I... Oh, shut it already. Lush says she forgives you. Say sorry and thank you first before you go all wishy-washy. Yes. I'm... I'm sorry. And thank you. Well, Lush had it worst of all from you. So if she's willing to forgive, I guess I can't be mad anymore either. What about you? It's okay with you? Really? Time for me to take responsibility as homeroom teacher. I know I may seem unreliable, but leave them to me. Mr. Mameo. What'll we do, Tauman? All we can do is drift along. I don't like it, but I suppose it's part of the flow of life. There you have it, Shoma Tsuzuki. Though, of course, we don't speak for the whole digital world, you know. I imagine a good number of folks won't be forgiving. Think very carefully about how you'll handle that. I will. So, everything's finally settled? Seems so. I can confirm that the network is recovering from its outages. It's a gamble whether things will work out with Omega Man Alter B, but at least the reincarnation's a success. That said, it'll take a good long time before the digital world is completely reborn. Meaning we won't be able to see it through ourselves. Think so. Honestly, I'm ready to get back to the real world as soon as I possibly can. So... It's goodbye? Once the reincarnation project is complete, you'll be able to summon everyone again, you know. Suzuki and I can come along on digital dives, too. So... I'll see you again? You bet. I'm definitely coming back here. Once things calm down. Well, why don't we make it official? Let's promise that we'll meet in the digital world again. Yeah! Here, give me your pinky. Hey, what are you doing? Get over here already. B but Just join in. I have a feeling there's a lot you can learn from this bunch. Seriously? Learn? From Kota? Sure. I can teach you uh, how to make your friends laugh or something. <laughs> sure you can. Yes. Please teach me that. Wait, he's actually serious. Here goes. We promise that when the digital world is reborn, we'll all meet here again. Looks like things are wrapping up. Shall we go? Thank you. I mean it. You too, Himari and Kota. When you get back, we're having a real feast. You have my deep gratitude as well. You've helped us in a real and true way. All right already. Um, why are you taking the compliments? I'm pretty sure our friend here worked the hardest. Come on, let's not be so tough on each other. 